Hello and welcome back to the channel. If you're brand new here, we are the Three Musketeers. My name is Andy. I, I, I and there is Charlie. And if you are brand new here, please do us a favor. Consider subscribing to our channel because we are halfway through our Walt Disney World 2024 series. However, we are not in Disney today. We have come down today. to today. I know my team drank it up, but we have come down today to Icon Park to go on that thing. How awesome does that look? Um, Icon Park very kindly have invited us down to come and experience the wheel man and two swords that they've got here and the so, sea life center. To show off the accessibility and how easy it is to enjoy the wheel if you have mobility issues. So we'll be showing you all of that plus has been invited for a spot of lunch. I know, I'm very much uh, we are. We are going to be tasting, what is it called? Barbecue, Brother, Brother Jimmy's Barbecue. Brother Jimmy's. Very much I am very excited about this. However, I'm wearing white and we're going to a barbecue place. It's alright, you've already got steak here anyway, so. Alright, you're right. You're right. right, should we get in there then? Right, let's go on in. This is how we get in. Wow. Look at that. Look at this inside here. Wow. So this is like the wheelhouse. Because believe it or not, I mean, look right up there through the ceiling. That is where, up there, that is where the actual wheel is. But this is like the uh, foyer bit full of food on that side, wheelhouse market. Uh, got Greek fruit, food, pizza, chicken on fire, tacos, uh, a Colombian ca uh, coffee place. And then just next door to it, that's how you get into sea life on that side. And then I think just on the other side, yes, just behind that bar is how you get into the waxworks. There is a little gift shop as well. We'll have a look at that when we come on out. But look at this, they've got a mold and matic Oh, that's so cool. Look, that's what you get. $8. Ooh, I like the look of that. All right, so it is uh, just before 11 o'clock. This is when the whole wheelhouse opens, but the wheel doesn't actually open until 1 o'clock. So what we're going to do, we're going to go across to Sea Life Centre first, go and have a look around that. Then we've got we'll go and lunch, and then we'll uh, go into the waxworks in a very short while. Right, let's go into sea life here in Orlando. This is, uh, we've never been to a sea life outside of the UK before. The last one we were at was uh, Manchester for part of our Vlogmas series. Alrighty, let's go. Ooh, look at that, underwater. Or undersea explorer theater. We love a good uh, like treasure hunt, don't we? So this one. Well, down. like it well, I was gonna say like it well. Mm. We have the scratch cards. Yeah. This is a stamp book. It's a stamp book. So we've got to find the answer and then collect the stamps. Uh, and then the stickers at the end. Amazing. Right, let's get on with that then. <laughs> Look at him in there. There's some more eels in here. And look, there's a uh, dragonfish or lionfish at the back. Now, I do know about these, these fish. You've got to keep away from the barbs because they are extremely sharp and poisonous as well. There's a huge moray eel in there as well. I'll have a look at him in a second. Hey, there he is. Hey, Charlie! <laughs> We're both in these little bubbles. But look, there's the moray eel. And there's some more of those there. Uh, Lionfish or dragonfish, as we call them here. But look at that. Look, Bex is outside the tech. Look, hello, love! <laughs> hello, Mother. Look at him, though. Wow. We stick our head in here. Look at these little things. They've got proper little faces. Let me, um, <laughs> let me zoom in on one. Look at his little face! Oh, those are so cute! Yeah. <laughs> look, Charlie's in a fish tank. <laughs> There's proper fish in there as well, look. Hey, look, I found Nemo already. There he is! Hey, Nemo! Oh, where are you going? 
So those are the dive station like stamps. Um, we just stamped it down and it actually embosses and stamps that fish shape onto the uh, logbook. Oh, I love a good jelly wall. Wow. Look at all them jellyfish in there. Alright, pick a colour. What are you having red? Look at them. I should just have something a bit lighter. Well, there you go, that's better. Wow, look at those. We get loads of jellies like this off the coast of Blackpool. So, look at this, you can learn all about shark conservation in this part. And can you believe this screen? How awesome is that? It's amazing, isn't it? Charlie's going to learn about a hammerhead shark. Wow. Look, Charlie, a starfish. See them little tubes? They're their legs. What? So, Charlie knows a heck of a lot about starfish. Um, those little tubes, those are actually legs that help it move along the ocean floor. How cool is that? I actually know all about starfish. Go on then, tell me a star, starfish fact. Um, on the top of the starfish, that's its mouth. Yeah. Which um, bit? So that, that bit in the middle? Them tubes are them legs. Cool. This is all about axolotls. Charlie's got an axolotl at home. Well, a cuddly toy version. This is so cool. <laughs> He's got inside again. <laughs> what have you found? Where have you found him? Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, they are very cute, aren't they? They're very cute, it's like the in the There's some more around the front here. Oh yeah, look, look they are Charlie, look. There's some oh. more there. Oh, look at that one smiling. That's the one I have. There's Leo. We found your axolotl. Oh, those are very cute. There's another one asleep here. So obviously everything that sea life does. Whoa, look at the size of that moray eel. I didn't even just notice him popping out. But yeah, everything sea life does is all that conservation. And particularly here in Florida, the Coral Restoration Foundation are trying to help natural coral regrow. So they are got these various stalks in different parts of the ocean off the coast of Florida. And they are attempting to help it grow. Fantastic is that. I love all of these ones where you could just literally dive into the adventure. How awesome is that? So what have we got here? Oh, it's an epilet shark. That's what that is. It's called Charlie. That is called an epilet shark. Wow, look at this tunnel. How awesome is this? Wow. Even got a glass floor as well. There's a couple of sea turtles. That's how Captain Jack escapes, you know. Sea turtles, mate. Got a few rays in there, isn't there? Interaction in the rock pool. So go and wash your hands first, pal. And then once he's done that, you can come over here and touch some of the things in the rock pool. Oh, 
I see you live. Um, we were in there, what about 45 minutes? Um, it's not the biggest one in the world. Um, certainly been to bigger, certainly been to ones that have got more exhibits. Um, no sharks in this one, apart from like the smaller ones, yeah. but no, um, yeah, not my favourite sea life. I want to take a quick minute just to tell you about this week's sponsor. We've teamed up with It's A Small World Candle Company on Instagram to bring you an exclusive Mouseketeer discount. They very kindly sent us one of their Polynesian Resort scented candles and a purple wall wax melt. They have a wide range of candles and wax melts available from the nostalgic scents of Disney's Main Street USA to the Polynesian Resort like what we received, also right through to Mickey Waffles. So if you want to be instantly transported back to Walt Disney World or into your favourite Disney moment, check out Small World Candle Company on Instagram. We'll link everything in the description box below. Make sure you use the code MOUSKETEERS10 to get 10% off your orders. Thanks very much for sponsoring this video. Now back to the vlog. So we've just come out of the Sea Life Centre and just having a bit of a wander around. Uh, there is a fair few things to do and see here down Icon Park. A fair few eating places as well. We are currently trying to find Brother Jimmy's Barbecue. That's where we're going. There's the place called the Yard House. Uh, Sloppy Joe's in front of us. Uh, they've even got a Build-A-Bear workshop, which is ace. Um, we should have known that actually, because we could have brought Charlie's Build-A-Bear passport and got it stamped. Oh, there's um, like a oh, Shake Shack over yeah, here as well. Yeah, your mum was recommending that, wasn't she? They've even got um, an Outback Steakhouse plus look they've got their own version of the star flyer like we had at Christmas by the Sea in Blackpool parking as well here on site and a little Disney gifts an Icon Park gift shop we are going to have a look at the one inside the wheelhouse because there are some t-shirts in there which I quite like the look of Just talking about the car parking, it is actually free, which is great. That is always good, isn't it? So floors four through seven are free parking. We are just making our way around now to uh, Brother Jimmy's. There are so many places to eat whilst you're here. You will be spoiled for choice. And some of them look amazing. I mean, look at this as well. What's this place, all red? That looks cool, doesn't it? Oh, did you see that on there, on that, that billboard? When it comes back round, hopefully it'll come back round quickly. The, the British Invasion, they are always playing at Epcot in the UK Pavilion. When it comes back round, come on. I want to see it. <laughs> it's going to make me out to be a lion now, isn't it? Ooh, that looks good. See the menu at allred.com. Hey, that's Blake Shelton. Is Blake Shelton on this? Yep. No, oh, all red, yeah. He did the song all red. Uh -huh. Oh my God, look at... <laughs> I'm only just putting two and two together here. Wow. I genuinely did not know that. That's so cool. Yeah, look at that. You can buy Blake Shelton merch here. I, <laughs> I love Blake Shelton. I've got like three or four of his albums. Yeah, definitely. Right, come on, let's carry on. Oh, I think we might have found it. Is this on the corner here? Brother Jimmy's barbecue, that's the one. Right, come on, Charlie, we found where we're going. Right, so this is where we are gonna go and have lunch. Uh, just for transparency, everything that we're doing today here at uh, Icon Park, so including this, the Sea Life, and the wheel, and two swords as well, um, is all being provided by Icon Park. So we just want it to be completely transparent for that, but we're about to go in here, they do pull pork, brisket, barbecue chicken. Oh, sounds amazing. Look at this inside here. This is Brother Jimmy's barbecue. My God, right? Again, I keep saying this. I said this the other night in the last vlog. I wish this place was smell vision because it smells immense in here. It just smells like a proper barbecue. I love this place. So the menu in here is immense. I mean, look, they've got a couple of different menus. I mean, the big one there 
They also gave us the lunchtime menu. Uh, for 15 bucks, you can get lunch and a beer Monday through Friday, 11.30 till 3 p.m. Oh, look at all this on here. Let us know in the comment section below what would you have? Would you have off the lunchtime menu or would you have off there? Bella, who's our server, has just recommended some Bush Puppies Pebbles, which I love Puppies, uh, with the maple butter. We're going to get some of the nachos, where have those gone? And we're for like the kind of our main, we are going to have this combo thing here, aren't we? Um, I think we're going to do two, with the, like the pick two, so I don't think we've quite decided yet, but the brisket and the grilled shrimp sounds good, or the pulled chicken, I don't know. Well, we shall decide and let you know. But again, let us know in the comment section below what would you have off this menu. So at the end of every table, you have got your cutlery on that side. There are three different types of barbecue sauce. There's bar Chipotle barbecue, uh, an original barbecue, and then it says Carolina on it. Is that going to be like Carolina Reaper chili? That's going to be hot. And there is some, uh, uh, what do you call it? Kitchen roll as well. Charlie's got a little menu, plus he's got games on the back, but look at the uh, holder for the pens, how awesome is that? Look at this, we forgot to show you the back of the menu, it's got all the drinks on it, you can get cocktails in mason jars, just how we like to drink our beer, and look, these are the different beers that they've got on tap, uh, I'm currently drinking a Blue Moon, I bloody love Blue Moon, oh they do buckets of beers as well. That's not bad. Okay, so the first app has arrived. Oh my God, is that for us as well? Whoa, this is the Hush Puppies with maple butter. Oh my God, look at that. <gasps> that's, that's for all of us, Charlie. What, that is crazy, man. <gasps> look at that. So little dude's happy, his hot dog and fries have arrived. Also, we have got some uh, fried Brussels sprouts on Bella's recommendation. Uh, Bella is our server and she recommended these, so we're trying on her recommendation. Someone else coming as well. Thank you so much. Wow, look at that. So we got fries on here, we got some cornbread, we have got barbecue ribs, we got brisket we got pulled pork and uh, no pulled chicken my god look at all this this looks insane oh my god these hush puppies are the bomb we got fried okra as well i bloody love yeah. mm. these believe it or not are fried brussels sprouts it tastes like crispy seaweed it, yes that's what it reminds me of crispy seaweed you are correct the brisket is amazing. I am about to tuck into um, some of this rib. I mean, my God, look at it. Oh, you've got to come and try this place, guys. Oh. <laughs> so look at this. These are Oreos, deep fried Oreos with vanilla ice cream. And they look and smell amazing. Why are we still here? Why are we taking photographs and videos and why are we not eating them? I don't know. Right, Charlie, go on, dive in, get one of them. Which one are you having? Are yeah. oh, you having the ice cream, are you? What about the actual it's Oreo? <gasps> He's nicking the ice cream! They do look fit, though. These are amazing. Look at this. Ah, deep fried Oreos. My new favorite thing. It's kind of almost like a donut filling around the outside. And then they got the Oreo inside. Oh, we need to make these when we get home. These are fab. Charlie, these are Oreo 
this place is right up my street. It's very cowboy in here, isn't it? If you know me, I like my cowboy stuff, I like my country music, I like my cold beer on a Friday night. I think it's just brilliant in here. And the food that we have had, wow. I would 100% come back here and have food, drink, appetizers. The hush puppies are fab. So guess who need the ice cream from the Oreo train. <laughs> Seriously though guys, we are going to get some to-go boxes because honest to God, there is so much food here. The portions, they do not skimp on them at all, which I suppose is the sign of a true southern barbecue, but wow, amazing. Those again, those were the uh, fried Brussels sprouts that Bex was on about a moment ago, but Seriously, if you are coming to Icon Park, please do stop in here at Brother Jimmy's and try the food. It is exceptional. Okay, time to go on the wheel. Yeah, I think we're all right for those. Yeah. No, we're okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Look at that, Charlie. Are you ready? So they've also got, um, you can get beer, wines and cocktails to take up with you, to enjoy while you're going around. You're 400 feet up in the air in one of these capsules. Right, so here we go. This is where we're gonna get on. Right, you ready, Charlie? Yeah, can you hold that? Can you keep it pointing? Right, you ready, Charlie? Let's go. 400. Look at that, roll on, roll off. Perfect. Oh. We are in. Look at that, how easy was that? Straight on, straight off. That's well good. See? Please stand clear. Attention. Please stand clear of the opening door. Here they go. There goes the closing door. Wow. We've got this entire capsule to ourselves. How awesome is this? And look, like I said, you can you can connect your own phone to have your own tag music here. Road, the Flamingo family is just coming up on the Florida State Line. So when we get to the very top of the here, she's very loud, isn't she? There we go, let's turn it down. So when we get to the very top of this, which we nearly are actually, Charlie, uh, we will be 20 feet higher than where the glass floor is on Blackpool Tower, which is crazy, isn't it? I mean, just look at this skyline. I feel like, I feel like I'm Kevin alone in this. Why do you feel alone in it? Look at your daddy here with you. But look out over here, we've got a uh, universal just in the background. We've also got Volcano Bay off to the left. I am trying to scour the skyline for uh, Disney. Universe, is it over here? The new universe. <laughs> is that Castle Isaac? No. No, it can't be. 
don't know, it's very, what is that? It's like a very pointy witch's hat. feet up in the air. Oh my God. Right, so that was quite cool. That took about 20 minutes to go around. We are just about to uh, get ourselves off here. As you can see, it is roll on, roll off. Amazing, thank you. Right. Can you hold this? Make sure you keep pointing out the floor so you can move the show and keep rolling along. Just like that. Okay, go on, babes. Off you go. Well done. Just keep hold a second, I'll get for you. Look at that, <laughs> I like that. That's a really nice colour shirt as well. Ooh. There's some great merch here. That is so cool. These are very cool. Um, how much are these? Let's have a, we've got a price tag, here we go. So the t-shirts are $24.95. That's not bad actually. Oh, but you could have a Christmas flamingo. Oh my god, look at that. That's awesome. We've landed back down on Icon Park. That was really, really good. I really enjoyed that. We're going to go into uh, Two Swords right now. I know this one. This is pink. We know pink. <laughs> uh, Vin Diesel is also over there. This is going to be quite funny actually, seeing how many of these wax works in here we recognize because obviously there's going to be quite a lot from American TV shows and movies we'll see how many we recognize but there's been Diesel as well I know it's going to be uh, interesting to see how many of these we know uh, I know this guy actually this is um, Juan Ponce de Leon you he, did not know that. I did you know this that yes I only read it but I know who this guy is he founded St. Augustine in Florida, which is the oldest city in the United States of America. You also read that before you put How am I supposed to read that from here? Yeah. You rascal. But yeah, he uh, he found the fountain of youth as well. Uh, oh look! It's Uncle Sam! So you're sat next to A. Lincoln and who? We shall Who's the other guy? That's the guy who signed the scroll. It is. That's George Washington, isn't it? Shall you owe your knowledge? And what's his name? Um, I thought... No, wait! Charlie, Charlie, you can plant, plant the flag on the moon. You can see yourself in the telly, look. Look, you're down there. Oh, I'm with, I'm with you. <laughs> Look. Look at that. It's fake news. Fake news. Fake. Fun fact about him, he went to jail. Hey, look. It's Barack Obama. <laughs> It's going to make everybody clean up the country, okay. Oh my God. It's Walt! It's Walt, Charlie! Charlie, look, I'm Einstein's behind you. <laughs> look, it's Andy Warhol, although, actually, if you uh, believe the story from Men in Black, He's actually an alien or an undercover agent. I can't quite remember. But he was so bored he started painting things like soup. Dale Earnhardt Jr. here. How cool is that? We got Muhammad Ali as well. And Avenger Holyfield. <laughs> oh, look at the background. 
Is that Venus Williams? Hello. Who's Dan Marino? Have you not seen Ace Venturi? He's from the Miami Dolphins. <laughs> so, look at this. This is Shaq O'Neal. He played, or did play, I don't know if he still plays, but he plays for the Orlando Magic basketball team. Look how tall he is. Charlie, go and stand next to Shaq. Look how that. Holy smokes, she's just above his knee. Look who it is. Beyonce. Hello. What are you doing? Look, we found Harry Styles. Honestly, Ariana Grande, she is just gorgeous. I mean, look, she's so cute. Uh, back off, Charlie, I saw her first. <laughs> so on tonight's late show with Jimmy, on tonight's show we've got... One of the three Mouseketeers, Charlie! <laughs> so, Charlie, what's it like being the biggest YouTuber and TikToker in Blackpool? What? Hi, Jimmy. Wait for it, because it's going to be legend. Hope you're not lacto- to... Wait for it, because I hope you're not lactose intolerant, because the next word is going to be legend. Dairy! It's Barney! <laughs> Fun fact, our dog Barney is named after Barney Stinson. <laughs> oh no, it's DC. Oh, Lex Corp, this is going to be Superman, isn't it? We are Marvel in our house. No, no, no. Breaking news out of Metropolis. Open the door. Oh no, look, we're at Mr. Flash. I don't mind Wonder Woman. Because Gal Gadot is just gorgeous. Oh, Superman here. Oh! Hey, Charlie! Isn't this, uh, isn't this Titan? Isn't this Titan? Charlie's an onion, he's got layers. <laughs> Gingy as well. Hey, look, Charlie, go and have breakfast at Tiffany's with uh, Sophie. Uh, oh, sorry, but what's it called? Audrey Hepburn. <laughs> Charlie, phone home. Phone home. <laughs> wow, is Zendaya really that tall? Wow, she is tall. Hello. Oh, look, it's your boyfriend, Mr. Tatum. Very bushy eyebrows. Stop drooling. <laughs> oh, okay. This is like probably the VIP we got. That's kind of Johnny Depp. We've got <laughs> DiCaprio over here. Um, kind of Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> That's kind of right. No, that's not Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> what about Tom Hanks? Tom Hanks. That's kind of alright. Now, we've met Samuel Jackson. Does he recognize you? I know. Sam, Sam, hi, it's me. It's me. Do you remember me? Mm, kind of, probably doesn't. Uh, who else have we got? We got Brad Pitt. Shall we just check on Emma Watson over here before we do anything else? Oh look who it is! It's Scuttle! It's Scuttle! But we have to check on them. <laughs> That's supposed to be Emma Watson. That's Hermione. That's Hermione Granger from Harry Potter. Oh, what have you done to Zac Efron? What have you done to the boy? No! He doesn't look right. His eyes are... No. No. No like. 
So there you go, that was our little trip out to Icon Park to go on the wheel and to also go to Brother Jimmy's, which we weren't expecting. And we also went inside Man and Two Swords and um, the Sea Center. So all in all, pretty good little day out here. Yeah. We would highly recommend the wheel. I thought it was good. And um, we would also recommend coming for Brother Jimmy's. So, so good. Yes, 100%. Um, accessibility is amazing. Getting on, getting on and off the wheel was just too easy. Oh, too right. Uh, and Brother Jimmy's so, so tasty. So much food. Um, we've got a goodie bag to go away with uh, so we'll be mentioning that the next few days but really really good uh, thank you very much to the team out here at Icon Park for having us out we are now going to go and meet a friend of ours off Instagram Maria we're very excited to go and see her so yeah let's get going look at this this Ripley's believe it or not auditorium how awesome is that my camera is level it just looks like it's falling down how awesome is that so that was our day out at Icon Park um, and Brother Jimmy's barbecue. They were really, really good, that, that place, wasn't it? It was really, really good. My all-time favorite thing that we've eaten in Florida. I will definitely be going back there again. If you are looking for somewhere to go and eat that is off the beaten tourist track, go and check that out. It's, it's unique. Um, you know, the servings are huge, as you saw really really nice but thank you to icon party for inviting us down just transparency that was all gifted for us and we very much enjoyed going on the icon wheel as well anyway if you've liked this vlog please go ahead and give it a like if you haven't subscribed already you know what to do but for now we'll see you real soon bye